If you thought the price of your favorite power tool batteries already hurt your wallet, there's more bad news and it's not just inflation. According to a Fox Business report, battery prices could increase even further thanks to simple supply and demand. While it certainly seems like we live in the golden age of cordless tool innovation, a storm is coming that's been getting more attention, the finite resource behind lithium-ion batteries. Regardless of what source you turn to, the blame largely falls on the auto industry as it currently consumes more and more lithium with the expansion of electric vehicles. According to an engineering.com report, most of our global lithium supply exists in Chile, Argentina, and Bolivia. Between strict controls and varying business policies, not enough lithium mining exists to keep up with rising demand. Letting lithium mining go completely unchecked also presents a poor option. As we watch the rise of electric vehicles and the massive numbers of lithium-ion cells they require, it's playing a large part in the lithium shortage we're currently facing, but there are other factors to consider. One is the effect that China has on the manufacturing processes and supply chain. Even though there's plenty of raw lithium in Australia, Chile, and even the U.S., it has to be processed before battery manufacturers can create the cells. As the world's largest processor of battery-grade lithium, there's real concerns surrounding the tensions between China, the U.S., and other countries. That's causing some lithium-dependent manufacturers to scramble and secure as much lithium as they can, creating higher demand and limiting supply. The result is lithium prices that were up around 240% in just the 2021 calendar year alone. However, there is light at the end of the tunnel, so don't just run over to your local Home Depot and buy them out of batteries for the cordless system you're on. There's a lag in finding raw supply and then getting the investment dollars, equipment, and infrastructure to mine it. Citing analysts from Citigroup, Fox Business says to expect production to exceed demand by 2025. There may be a twist in the plot, though. As lithium mining gets closer to home in Nevada and North Carolina, so do the environmental concerns of the mining process. It'll be interesting to see how cultural sentiment reacts to large-scale lithium mining in the U.S. and how regulators respond to that. If you enjoyed this video, hit the like button and subscribe to our channel to stay up to date on our latest content. Want to know more? Links to our full written pieces on the lithium shortage are available in the description below. Have any questions or want to share your own view on the story? Let us know in the comments, and as always, thanks for watching.